Hello my darlings and welcome back to San My Shuno. We are in the Uptown District area once again today. Last time at the Hamptons apartment we managed to furnish up the living area and dining room. Today we're going to be concentrating on the kitchen, the main entrance and also the hallway. So let's get in and start furnishing. Happy Tuesday my darlings and welcome back once again to Let's build the world hello welcome so sorry about last week the illness got me i was really really poorly last week so i just couldn't get all of the videos out that i wanted to so apologies for that and it could not have came at a bloody worst time either because i go away on holiday next week and i'm gonna, only going to be getting out a speed build while I am away. So it came at the worst time because I wanted to get videos out for you guys, but sometimes illnesses happen, you know? And it's always this bloody time of year as well. Like towards the end of the summer, I always get a bloody cold. But here I am, I'm back again. I'm not 100% better just yet. You can probably still hear it in my voice, but I'm definitely getting there. I really am. So this is what we did last time. I've done a few changes using that amazing new kit, that new modern luxe kit. I really, really like it. I really love it. Love the new kind of like frame-esque TV that came with it as well. And look what we've got now. What was I saying last time? What was I saying last time what we needed? And look what we've got there. I'm not really sure about it on this table. I think this table looks a bit too small here for this one. So I think I need to change this around and swap it out for another table. So let me do that first. And we'll make a start on that bloody cheeky kitchen over there. I think it would look a lot better on this one, which is uh, it's in the miscella miscellaneous surfaces from Get to Work. I think that one works well. It's just a bit longer. I think it would just fit that space a little bit better. And if I can flop that up there, no, it doesn't like to go up on top of any surface. So I had to put this up with the cheeky red shelf but i think that i think that's gonna work i wouldn't mind some kind of decorations either side of there but that looks a lot better than what it did yes it did indeed so that's what we're gonna do today as i said uh kitchen we're gonna also do the main entrance hall here and also this hallway going all the way through and then tomorrow we're gonna make a start on the bedrooms and probably gonna need another two parts to make to finish off the bedroom so maybe we'll start on the parents room and then we'll go on to one of the teens room and make a start on that next week we'll finish it off i am away next week as i said but i will probably be able to get out a let's build the world plus a speed build as well so there's not too many videos i'm gonna miss let's see what happens all right i'm just gonna keep it easy breezy easy breezy 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 so here we are we are in the kitchen now th this does cut in slightly it doesn't really from the outside which i like but it does on the window here but i'm fine with that absolutely fine with that i don't know what kitchen i want to use yet i think it's probably going to be one of the kitchens from dream home decorator because i think it would fit in with this style quite nicely oh see that does go really nicely with this um oh that that in fact let me try, let me let me just see let me just see oh that's better that is better that one just because the woods match in a little bit nicer not really keen on the gray top of this one for some reason Mm, I wasn't really keen on that grey, so we're going to go for the white top instead. But I do want to do like a little island in here as well with some bar stools. So we can bring some, maybe some black accents over by use of that. And maybe some black shelves. Um, Yeah, black bar stools and like black shelves. And maybe some pendulum lighting in the kitchen. We'll see. We'll see what happens. So here we go. I am going to maybe make a start there like that. The only problem with these, I don't really like the corner pieces. I don't really like the corner pieces so can I like just put in this instead and just pretend that that is the end piece there if I like whiffled it around that way let me have a look at that you know what I'm not angry at that I hate hate I know it's only a, it's just a me thing I hate seeing tea towels hung on anything Tom does it with the oven he hangs a a towel over the on the oven like handle Virgo absolutely get that get that off now and put it Put it where it belongs. <laughs> oh, Tom. Yeah, that's a bit better. We'll do that. We'll just tuck them in like that. Stunning. Is this light a bit bright in here? I mean, not really. It's fine, but I know it is a bit bright. We'll go for this one. Softer, softer lighting. Okay, oven here. So I want to continue on this one into... No, not you, my love. You to there. We'll do a corner piece here. Oh, in that corner. Um... I think I want to continue on down, maybe just a couple more. Put a fridge here. Maybe have some kind of unit up here. 
we'll see we'll see what happens with that but i think this would be the perfect layout for it nice big kitchen as well uh i'm sure if i want to do cupboards i'm thinking more black shelves for some reason but we'll soon find out we'll find out what a peck while we're here we may as well get in the uh the island shouldn't we hmm do i want to go double with it i think i do i think i want to go like boop and a boop the only problem with that is it then looks like a full white island you don't get that detail with the, like the cupboards and drawers which i really like so maybe not actually what i'll do is put the island around about here one two there yep and then we'll do corner pieces on each corner so left hand piece goes on the left hand side which is over this way <laughs> i'm learning i'm learning how islands work in the sims it's only taken me you know eight years but we got there in the end darlings didn't we i can do like a long island mm, yeah i think that's gonna work as soon as bar stools are in there i think that will work quite nicely especially with a unit here yeah okay i'm 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 all right with that for the minute we'll see what happens we need to find a fridge and an oven so that's what i've decided to do you can probably see i've changed the wallpaper as well the white tiles were just like it was just looking a bit too stark for me in here i think just by softening it down using the batu wallpaper which i absolutely love by the way um it just gives it a bit of texture makes it look a little bit more modern now with the island i extended it out just on one end and left this end flat over this side it was a bit too big here uh and it still gives us that little bit of brown detail which is what it's got on the uh, counters itself do you know what i'm kind of for that i really bloody am yeah okay so we need some bar stools don't we so we're we're going for a bit more of a med med a mid-century vibe in here but i do as i said want to get in that kind of black accent oh what about these these ones here from the uh desert Lux pack yeah i'm kind of feeling that yes i am feeling that in here that looks wonderful oh did you hear my wrist crick then how very dare it I'm getting old because i've been in one position all week like oh, i'm dying <laughs> i've literally been playing so much fucking starfield honestly i'm very much into that game it's very janky it's a very much a bethesda game um it is it is very very janky but it's i'm having loads of fun with it let me know who's playing it down in the comments below i will get up to date with all my comments as well i'm going to answer all of my comments today so expect well they would have already been answered by now because it's going to be a Tuesday for you and it's Monday for me when I'm recording this. Uh, black shelves work. I do like that. We need something up here. We need something up on there. I don't know what I want to do there. I think I'm going to carry these along maybe even right to the edge of the fridge. Yeah, I like that. Oh, I do like that, yes. Do they need to come down one more? I think they're a bit high. Let's go down one more. Either way, here and here there and there and yeah lovely bloody lovely but um yeah i'm very much looking forward to my holidays well i haven't had a holiday this year and i've needed a holiday this year my god have i needed a holiday so i'm very very excited for it thank you to all you guys that understand that i sometimes i just need some time off and things you know um i really appreciate it it doesn't go unnoticed i'm not going to take the piss but when I do need some time off and stuff, I will take it. And I think that's the trouble with a lot of creators out there. They're always scared to. They're all scared that people's not going to come and watch their videos afterwards. And I have you guys, you know, I know that you're always going to be there for me. Um, which makes me very happy. Makes me very happy to have a wonderful, beautiful community such as yourselves. Um, to, yeah, just, you know, makes, warms my tuppence, loves. It really, really does. It absolutely heats up my tuppence like there's no tomorrow <laughs> it really does that looks wonderful i only put that in there as a whim but i actually kind of like that in here oh i think i'm gonna go for it i'm gonna go for that definitely do we need pendulum lighting in here i think over the um the island would look really nice i'm still gonna keep these spotlights i think but i think maybe i'll move the spotlights across here and then put some pendulous lights above the island itself. Now, there's a catch-22 with this because I like two lights in here. I like this one here in the black, but I also really like this light. Now, the only problem with this light is it doesn't really go down as low as what I would want it. 
I kind of prefer that one in here. I think it works a bit better than this one. Yeah, I think I'm going to go for that. We're going to go for this one here. Let me just see the swatches on this. This one works, but I just want to see other swatches. Oh, I do like the black. But yeah, I like that one. We'll go for that one. Just that little bit more black. I think that's going to, I think that's going to work a little bit better. I am feeling a plant coming on. I'm feeling an absolute plant. Can we, did we get any plants with the modern Lux pack? I can't remember. Oh, we did. Yes, we did. This one. I've already used it though. I'll put you over in that corner. Oh, oh, do you know what? Never mind. We'll use another one. Um, let me see if I can find one for this corner here. Do you know what? Why don't we go for this one here? Why don't we go for the one that came with that basement treasures? Yeah, I do like that. I like that a lot. Did I do a hangy plant over here? I did, but it was in a different color. So I'll use this one. And I don't think I'm going to size this one down over here. And what I'll do is just go for the default lovely green one. There we go. Um, I'm going to flop you over there a little bit, my darling. Is that all right? Yes, it is, Aiden. Not that. Not a plant answering back, please, Aiden. It's not the time. All right. Anyway, so as I said, we need something over here. I'm think. Oh, do you know what, actually? I think it would work. I think it would absolutely work here. In that colour as well. Putting some pots and pans up there. They do love to cook this family. They're very much into their food and stuff. So I'm feeling that it's going to be a vibe there. I like this kitchen. I think it's came along swimmingly. I really, I really bloody do. We haven't done a sink. I know we haven't. But I'm wondering whether to put the sink here. And do a dishwasher over here. Yeah, I think I might do that. Let's put the sink in. Let's get a nice little cheeky sink. Nice black, tall, tapped sink. Tall tap. Like that. Yes. And then do the uh, the dishwasher over here. Now, I know it's, for, it's away from the sink and you have to walk across the kitchen. But for goodness sake, honestly, I'm sure someone can walk across. I think I'm going to do it in black as well rather than white like the other. Um... Uh, what would you call them? Appliances? Yeah, we'll do that. Oh, I'm vibing with this. Yeah, I do like this kitchen a lot, actually. Okay. Well, I'm happy with that. I'm absolutely snappy happy. I think what I want to do is just litter this uh, shelving unit up with some bits and bobs. And there we go. Just added some detail in, some plates, some cups, some uh, jars of pickles and whatnot. Olives, pots and pans. Did a coffee machine i also bought out a microwave as well and put the microwave down by the uh, fridge i love that i do like that kitchen i think that kitchen is nice i think it suits this aesthetic that we've got going on in here as well made up absolutely made up with that okay well i'm happy with this room i think it's perfect absolutely perfect i would like a little picture up here now I, I'm sure you've seen the kit pack. It is absolutely stunning. I'm going to keep singing its praises. I don't know how to pronounce. Is it Xrelia or Rela? Rela? I don't know how to pronounce their name. Um, wonderful creator over on YouTube. Gorgeous, gorgeous tastes. And uh, kudos. Kudos to you, my darling. Because I am absolutely thriving with this. Or especially this painting. This painting is just absolutely beautiful. I love it. So I'm going to use all of these and the swatches going all of the way down this hallway because I just think it would fit in perfectly. But this one here, for some reason, I love it. Oh, oh, I just love that little hint of gold in there as well. I think that's beautiful. Yes, five in with that. We've obviously got a piano as well. Did say musical family. Yeah, into it. Okay, well, we're going to do this main entrance. Um... We're going to do this main entrance now and we'll probably get on with the toilet as well so let me just pull out a few things for in here because i don't know what, what vibe i want to go for in here or what to even put in here just yet let me have a little think and i'll be right back so i've kept it kind of simple and as simple as what i'm going to make this hallway as well i'm just going to have this hallway all about that amazing new art i'm just going to put it all the way down here um but with the entrance bit we're going to use these we're going to have a little seating area just here just in from when you come in through the front door. I'm going to put a mirror just behind it like that. A nice glow up glam mirror. Uh, this little plant is going to go over in this corner here. Or oh, gorgeous like. Ah, yes, I'm feeling that. And I thought a little side table with a lamp on would look nice in here. So I've gone for that side table. And put that lamp on in the corner there. I think that's gorgeous. 
uh, a little umbrella rack. I'm going to put that one down on that side there. And then obviously we need some kind of doormat as they come in um, to wipe their feet on. Now I know this door does not go with this apartment, but that is the Sims for you. Uh, but I like that. I think it's very simple, very clean, very glam. And yeah, I'm vibing with it with this house. I really am. Really am. So on to this. Now I'm wondering, shall I keep them this size or shall I size them up? I think I'm going to size them up, but I'm going to use the tall mod so they're not too big. Let's get you at that level there. I'll change the swatches. Don't you worry. Um, I'm going to put them on each of these first. I think I want to do... Uh, how many swatches is or does this painting have? I can't remember. I mean, it's got a few, but it comes in different frames. So I'm not going to be too worried about what uh, frame color it is. I think it would be... Oh, hello, darling. <laughs> you know, she, she was like... <laughs> Oh, sorry. I just had a coffin fit then. <laughs> I just had a bloody coffin fit. The cough is still lingering. She's still there. I don't know if I told you about her, but I have got a cough. Um, I'm going to size these up. I think we're just going to do it like a 1.2. And then we'll change the swatches together. I think we're going to scale them up to like a 1.2. Let me just see this. Yes. Yeah, I think that's the perfect size. Untoggle that group. And let's go around and pick some of these beautiful swatches. I love them. Uh, we'll go for that one. We've already got one of you, my darling. So I don't want you back again. Love that one as well. Love the shoes. Absolutely into that. What else have we got going on here? We've got you. We've got the perfume bottle. I think that's it. For, oh, that's it for the designs. Oh, the one. Mm, yeah, no, there's more designs. I don't really feel the perfume bottle in here, but I think I'm going to do it anyway. So there's no more designs. So that one there has got to go, really. That's a shame. That is a shame. But I think I'm not liking the spacing of this now. I think we need to space this out a bit better. It doesn't really matter if they're not like in the middle of the panels. I just want the spacing to be a little bit more wider from each other. Maybe there and then you there. Is that right? No, no, no. This needs to come along one more and you do as well. Is that right? I think that looks right. <gasps> oh, I love that. I do like that. And then getting these all above it as well. Yes. Yes. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe this family is really into supporting other artists of colour, you know? And that is a famous artist in the city um, that has done all of these beautiful paintings. <gasps> yes, I'm vibing with that. I just like that, like, galley, like that gallery wall going all the way down do we maybe need to bring it down one am i being fussy am i being a fussy bitch i think i might be i oh i think i might being might be being a fussy bitch but you know virgo what more can i say and it is virgo season thank you all for, for your um birthday love as well last week i appreciate it i was poorly on my birthday i was absolutely fuming about it um but yeah, <gasps> do you know what? I'm vibing. I'm vibing with that. I don't think that needs anything else down here. Maybe a little full length mirror on that bit there, though. Mm. It needs to be modern. It needs to be a modern mirror. It can't be anything kind of classic looking. Uh, oh, we can go there. So a full length modern mirror. I think what I'll do is just stick with these and just do like a little square moment at the bottom. Because I love that you can overlap these mirrors. I really do. Yes. Yeah, I like that. I do. I'm not going to put anything on this wall here. I'm going to have that wall as the moment going down. <gasps> oh, I'm vibing, loves. I'm absolutely thriving and vibing. And it's all a big fat vibe. That's all I can say. Yeah, cute. Okay. Well, we're done with that today. Well, as I said, what we'll do is come back tomorrow and we're going to make a start on the parents' room and one of the teams. I don't know what team we're going to make a start on. Um, but we'll we'll get it finished. If if not, we'll spend the whole time on the parents' bedroom and the bathroom, and then we can do a full part with the teen bedrooms instead. I might do that actually. We'll see. We'll see. So tomorrow's part might be a little bit shorter, but we'll find out. We'll find out together. Yes, we will. Anyway, we'll leave on the lovely kitchen that we've just done. Thank you so much for watching today, my darlings, and for the patience of waiting for me um, while I was going through my illness. Um, but yeah, anyway, leave me some lovely comments, you gorgeous buggers, and I'll see you all tomorrow in my next video. Goodbye.